And, <laughs> and I think you shared with me that there was never a Monday that wasn't a bigger Monday than the prior Monday. Yeah, it's still the same case. I mean, DeviantArt uh, reaches a new traffic record roughly every, well, it depends on the time of the year. When people are in school, uh, you know, it's, uh, there's a demo proportion of our demographic that people go to school. So uh, these days, it's actually our Saturdays and Sundays. Our Sundays are our biggest days. But in the summers and in other times off, it's the, week, the weekdays. So, um, but every week we had a traffic record. And how does DeviantArt make money? We make money, um, our first business was, um, there was no advertising market, that had plummeted. So we had to invent something but new. But at the time you had a lot of advertising. Not in 2000, 2001, 2002. Right, there okay. was just, it was all nothing. Okay. So we had to invent essentially a subscription model. Um, and we asked the community to spend $30 a year to buy a premium membership or a subscription. And was there anyone doing that online? Not really. Um, in fact, I, the same moment, I started a little company with a couple of friends called Direct Access, and that was supposed to be essentially a gateway to build subscription models like a cable bill um, for websites. And so we could actually monetize because there was no advertising revenue, and therefore all of my friends who wanted to make cool stuff like in cool websites couldn't do it. I was like, well, what if there was a, direct, a business that would help you guys make money I mean, I was thinking like that on the side. Kind of like the lawn mowing business. Right, so, <laughs> something. Yeah, so what if you guys could make money by having a, a package, and so DeviantArt would have a subscription model, and then this other website would have one, and we would figure out a way to have one bill, which would ultimately be a little cheaper than buying a subscription to all, and, you know, and then we, you know, we didn't have OAuth 2, so you couldn't like Facebook connect, and that broke the business model down.